piața mai era, am pierdut. Dacă am contrat cu asta, mai rău. Nu uitați să dați like, să lăsați un comentariu și să distribuiți acest material video pe alte rețele sociale. The Rasta community is very large, and there are a lot of influential Rasta man and Rasta woman out there with money. I think we need to pull together and um, get a lawyer. Or if there is a lawyer within the Rasta community, I appeal the DPP decision and take back the police to court. You can appeal. Whatever decision they make, you can appeal. Even them sentence you for life, you can appeal and go back to court. See? So, only need for appeal decision there and go back to court. You understand? Because at this point, it's still her word against the police word. You understand what I'm saying? And I mean, I think the, the DPP decision is fair. At least charge her, make sure you go to court. Make them back it out in a court. We need a trial. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So, I put a charge her for all of them charge her with my and name out. Then you have to charge the politician them with broke protocol too. Anyway, we don't want to spend too much more time on that. Because you see the live done a while ago. Kerry, you look like them live here. Yeah. Them things here in Jamaica. Rasta is the biggest thing out of Jamaica. Rasta is the biggest thing out of Jamaica. A Rasta then use promote then tourism. Rasta then use promote culture, music, everything. In this good, good black history month, a black woman, the DPP rule, say no charges against the police. We cut off the young lady locks. Alright, so me am giving a little reminder. Me am play one video, part of it, with a little reminder how the incident come about. You understand? Um, and then we are going to talk about how people fool fool when them read things when newspaper use for, for get um, attention. Headline, headline grab them. They don't think for themselves. They don't go back to like the start of the story and get the information and know. So no matter what them see on video now, where police are going to show he not justify nothing, no matter what DPP say, and no matter what police them want to say. The, the young lady was abused by the police, and there should be charges. So, we well, may play back the video. This is from back in August. Talk. When the mother talk, and the young lady tell of the incident. So, I want to hear how the incident go. I was sitting in a taxi, waiting on the taxi to load up. I was there sitting, I saw a young man rushing towards the taxi. Listen. He then came in the taxi and sit and I saw two police officers short, coming shortly after. Listen, no police are being with people over wear masks, you know. What aborted the taxi to remove himself from the taxi. He did not comply, so one of the police officers came in and draped him. After draping the, the man, police the man, man punch the police taxi officer in his face. Now. They were there. They start fight. Quarreling and the other policeman came around there and said, okay, you know, come out of the taxi and I go give you something. To come out of the taxi, remove his pepper spray and he spread it in the car. Spray and I care what everybody did. Sitting down, a lady was there breastfeeding in the taxi. The policeman behaved as if he did not care about what he had done. So I came out 
I was angry because I was there observing the protocols, having all my mask and everything, and you came there just to remove one occupant and your pepper spray in the old car. So I was there, I had to remove my mask because I was not breathing properly, having all my mask and being pepper sprayed, I can't breathe properly. I was there for ventilating and I removed my mask. I was so upset because of the situation, so the policeman claimed that I had disrespected him. You see how them stay? Them go after a man who not have any mask. The young lady, them mind her business, is in a taxi, have a fear mask. Police and man catch up. Next police pepper spray the entire car with a female breastfeeding a baby. So a baby get pepper spray too. Enzinga get pepper spray. And she upset over it and she vocal about it. So them upset. Them are going to say she disrespect them. Right? And if he ever he did not do anything wrong, so I was no, there. No, they said they were going to arrest me for not wearing a mask. I was brought to the police station. I was told that I was charged for not observing um, COVID-19 protocols, not wearing... By the way, I want to listen to the young lady and tell me if this young, young lady sound like nothing wrong with her, like... She not mentally capable to represent herself or to remember what happened or talk about She talks straight and she intelligent and she use up her words them properly. Better than enough of them. In a mask. On the, day of, on the day of court, I arrived at court. My name called. I went in. I was told that I wasn't charged for a mask. I was charged for disorderly conduct. I was there, I explained to the judge what had transpired. Um, they did not um, explain to me properly what, um, what was going to take place. They did not explain to me that I could pay the, six, the fine of $6,000. I, I only heard when he said 10 days in the lockup. So one of the police officers escorted me downstairs where I would be waiting for the police officer to come and transport me to the station. Yes, because guess what? Them so wicked and evil that her first option is to pay $6,000 fine and go home. But no one instructed her how to get the fine paid. Instead, they put her to wait to be locked up. These dirty people. These dirty people did this. Yes, and the police that me attack to, and the judge them, and the whole of them when I justice system, which is so corrupt. And arrival at the four pass police station, I was sitting on so them actually transport her from the courthouse to the police station to lock her up when she should have just paid the fine at the courthouse and go yard. Inch, I was then asked to go in the bathroom to stand up. I was asked to go into the bathroom. I was there when the um, Miss Mitchell, Corporal Mitchell had led me to the bathroom. She had a scissors in her hand. I did not know what was her intention, but I was there standing in the bathroom complying with the rules um, rules or whatever they said i was there and she said pull out a ear let loose me a ear young lady and i was there at first i didn't comply with loosening my hair and i was still standing there she said young lady you know, hear me say to remove remove um the school she's from your ear i didn't remove my hair she started cutting my ear after cutting my ear once the scissors that she was using did not cut my ear properly so she called for another scissors mm. so she cut my now imagine the young lady recount the incident you know from start to finish and we're supposed to watch a video of an upset young lady being treated crazy by the police and believe that she sat in a cell and tear out her entire head of locks over two days period oh them never tell me that before from august and then i see it so them a liar and wicked my ear twice because after she the scissors no work good call locks and for cut so them go for a different scissors or whatever but she used another scissors to cut my ear i then bend down and take up some of the ear and i had it in my hand i was there and then she put me in the cell in lockup i was in lockup from thursday night i was on my menstruation i could have changed my clothes i couldn't change my sanitary napkin i could have bed i got nothing to eat my aunt and this is the norm when you go to jail especially 
if you're not in the parish where your family is. People, oh no, listen what the young lady said. She did dip on her menstrual cycle. No one catered to her going to the bathroom. She had to stay like that for two days. This was after being traumatized and getting her locks cut. Friday, my mother came. On Thursday, I got locked up. Friday, my mother came with snack, water, and stuff. They, they denied my mother. They did not take that visit. They denied the visit. Punish them or punish her because she thought the things them. Punish them or punish her because she upset and cussed them off. The video just shows her cussing them off before her locks were cut. It shows her when she was in the station before she even went into a cell. That's what that video shows. A very upset Enzinga. She in her uniform blouse. She coming from school. Get pepper spray in a taxi. Well pissed off. She cussed them off bad. They go play the video. I'm one who all who are judge her and I say, oh, her behavior was this and her behavior was that. What a way on a decent. If you went police a man hang on one a hall on clothes and a deal with no so on remain very decent and nice and cordial and now course. Not true. On lucky. Uh, so the mother says she take the they, they snack them but they not take the food. The clothes. The clothes, they not take the food. Um from Thursday night. No, imagine they not you're not more stuff to eat and your and people care food and they might take it. She brought some food some to be poor is a crime. Sunday is the official. To be black is a eat. crime in a Jamaica. They did not give me that food until six o'clock in the evening. When I got the food, the food was sour. I couldn't eat the food because the food was the food had closed with it. Like she no human being, she no human being. She no human being, just like Mario Dean where they lock up for one ganja spliff and make man kill off in a jail. Him never human being either. Wicked. Vegetable and everything and it's so I couldn't eat the food because the food was sour. I was there so stressed out, traumatized. A current situation had happened to me and that still had impacts on me. And in the lock up, I can't get anybody to talk to. I was in the lockup. Um, I was in the lockup, and Monday my mother came, and my mother paid the six thousand dollar, and I was released from lockup. Surprisingly, on Monday, when only to see a little, they brought a little girl to me without no locks on her head, because believe me, I I I couldn't even identify my daughter at the time when I. So the young lady described the entire incident. So, me want to know if fear testimony and fear experience no come into play when the DPP and make her stupid decision. But there should be no charges. Now, them a come with this liar story, say, the two day where the young girl lock up for, she sit down and tear out her entire head, Alex. This make any sense to other people? This make any sense? Between the DPP, Harris Chang, the Prime Minister, Tough than the, the um commissioner police, the whole of them is one set up. I don't know what to call them. I don't know what to call them. The DPP stress out the people, them family, stress out the young lady, and then the police them are tell lie. The police them on our conspire. Jamaica constabulary force on our conspire. Fin not not come out of this, but I hope them take on to the privy council. I hope she gets support for reach as far as she can go with this. Forget justice. Them come now, I come show a video. Let me find that the video there. When she accost them, yeah, me would have cost them too. Yeah, right? I get it. But me, me, me would tell them, say, if me have a gun, me that shoot them. But she never have a gun and she never shoot them. What crime she commit? She never have a gun and she never shoot them. Them have gonna shoot people. Them they shoot the pregnant woman up at St. Thomas. The pregnant woman was cussed bad word to the police them and sent Thomas when dead with her baby in her belly. Them did shoot her without warning and nothing still can't come out there. So why if Enzinger want to tell the police them say oh she feel inside to all them wicked. If she didn't have a gun, she'd have shoot them when I go on like on so decent. Like she should have said that like when I never say worse and some man who are the worst. I want know what kind of crime she commit. If you talk how she feel or how she upset over what them do to her. News. Wicked or no wicked? They can't talk when police lock we are powered with their road. Police must just abuse we anyway. Them have the young lady pan the video a hall and pull a hall and pull. Uno can go pan YouTube go watch it. 
And then when she attacked, no police are going to tell her about shut up your mouth in your soul.